All right, so the first thing you wanna do is turn your wheel inward. If you look right up in here, there's an access panel. And so what we're gonna to need to do is, we're gonna to need to rotate these guys here and I'll show you how to do that to get access to the light bulbs. I'm just gonna take this coin and you're just gonna rotate that guy There you go. So this kind of give you an idea of what you're removing here. All right, you guys, you see that little retaining clip right up here? What you want to do is you want to push that up. You're going to pop that up. That box should just come right off. So you can see I just you're going to have to use a little bit of force, push that retaining clip up, and just remove the box here. So now what that does, it gives us access to the bulb. So now what you want to do is you want to remove the little black power clip that you see right here. All right, there's a retaining, a little metal clip that you see right here, right above that connector. You're going to push in and either pull to the right or the left. Just depends on what side of the vehicle you're on here. All right, so you can see here, I got everything disconnected. We're just going to remove the bulb. Took a little finagling to do this here, to be honest with you. All right, so we got the new bulb. We're just gonna put this bulb in. Make sure you have that little piece right there pointing upwards. So with the new bulb in, you want to engage the safety clip first and then plug it in. And so we're ready to plug this in, test it out. All right, so now we're ready to put this guy back into place. Make sure you hold on to it because I dropped it back behind here and I had to take a screw off down at the bottom to get to it. So hold on to it. In fact, I probably encourage you to use two hands to come up above where you can get it into place. Lift that clip up. Now we're ready to put the access panel back on. <laughs> 